Sabha is an Arabic word that means salt flat. The salt flats of the UAE are living environments. They are constantly moving and reacting to the climate. They also absorb CO2. One square meter of Sabha absorbs more CO2 than one square meter of rainforest. In our exhibition, Wetland, we focused on the climate. Today, cement is 8% of global CO2 emission. It is a very serious problem that we have to address. To produce one ton of cement, you emit one ton of CO2. It's a very uh, archaic material. If it was discovered or invented today, it would not be approved because the amount of CO2 that is emitted is just merely unacceptable. In order to find a new binder that can replace the lime in Portland cement, we started looking at the geography of the UAE and discovered the Sabhas. We realized that Sabha could be used to create architecture, but we did not at all want to promote the extraction of Sabhas. Hence, we started questioning where could we source magnesium oxide from other than the natural geography. We started turning towards industrial waste. This exhibition is a collaboration between us and Tokyo University, two laboratories, Sato-san's laboratory, as well as Obuchi-san's laboratory, as well as a collaboration with New York University Abu Dhabi, specifically the Amber Lab, and a collaboration with the American University of Sharjah, the Biochemistry Laboratories. In the exhibition, you see three large format pictures of sabhas that are taken by Farah al Qasimi. The photos of Farah clearly capture this tension between industrialization, modernity, landscape, and nature. You can see the struggle that nature goes through to sustain itself with the need of countries to develop and build. We also have a prototype that is on display. The material is made from the reject brine of desalination water. We wanted to pay an homage to the vernacular architecture of the UAE. So the form or the shapes are inspired from corals. They are all drawn into soil molds and then cast. This cement needs to absorb CO2 in order to gain its structural strength. We've also on display sabha pieces that we've gathered from the local landscape and geography of the UAE, as well as some studies of different materials and cement experiments that we did in our laboratories in Dubai. It's important that architects of the 21st century start to re-question their roles and responsibilities. The architect lost touch of his role as a designer, the material, and the construction process. It is time that we hold ourselves accountable to the decisions that we make moving forward. Otherwise, there will be no planet left for us to inhabit by 2060.